Here's your WNEM TV5 news update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Trevor Sahaki. Here's a look at the top stories we're following today. Michigan State Police are investigating after two ATM machines were stolen in Swartz Creek and Flint Township. Both PCF Bank ATMs were recovered, as well as a stolen pickup truck. No suspects are in custody at this time. Happening tomorrow, the opening statements in the Flint Water Crisis Bellwether Trial. A jury will consider whether two engineering companies bear any responsibility for the lead contamination that poisoned thousands. The companies say their contract did not include water quality. The trial begins tomorrow morning at 9 in a U.S. District Court in Ann Arbor. It's expected to wrap up Thursday. And today marks the fourth anniversary of the death of 10-year-old London Eisenbeis. She died of a cardiac event while at a Frankenmuth water park. It was later discovered she had an undetected heart condition. The London Strong Foundation will be selling London Day Blue Out shirts at Bubble BT in Grand Blanc. All proceeds help the organization buy AEDs for the community. And now here's Matthew with a look at your forecast. Thank you, Trevor. Good Sunday morning. We are expecting a little bit of a breezy Sunday, but just slightly less breezy than Saturday and just a few snow showers coming in on this Sunday morning. Past that, though, generally a dry Sunday. But as far as those wind gusts go up to around 20 to 25 miles per hour out of the northwest, eventually seeing improvement by dinner time and especially into the upcoming overnight hours, actually looking at a fairly light wind for this Sunday night. But wind chills today staying in the lower 20s through the day, although in the 20s, that is a tad warmer than our wind chills from Saturday and our high temperatures this afternoon just above freezing for the Tri-Cities 34 36 in Flint over only looking at the middle to upper 20s up north as a cold front is moving through so that's not going to allow them as much time to warm up through this Sunday. A few snow showers and flurries coming in up north too along with that cold front but those will move out by the afternoon. We are talking a dry Sunday afternoon and dry into the overnight with skies clearing out just a cold start to Monday morning with temperatures in the single digits then a few snow showers coming in up north on our Monday afternoon and into the evening. Evening, a few of those lingering into Tuesday morning. Wednesday, we're still looking at another clipper moving through some light snow showers there. Thursday and Friday were dry with partly to mostly cloudy skies both days, but a chance at some sunshine. Temperatures warming back up to around 40 degrees by Saturday next weekend, but also tracking the possibility for some rain. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24-7 for the latest news, weather, and information.